Hey guys, I'm gonna do a new cat unboxing. I'm pretty sure it's a cat. If I'm right, this is a brand new Cat 330DL and 963. Yep. Papers. New Cat, cat new Norscott catalog. Just a little card. Notice it has the brand new Cat Norscott Cat D7E on it. That will order. More papers. A Tonkin replicas thing. That looks pretty cool. Some Christian thing. I'm not a Christian, so some candy. Okay. Let's start. I'm sure everybody knows about 3000 Toys famous wrapping paper. There's the 330DL. Here's the 963D. Let me get this out of the way. Let me recenter the camera. Okay, that's better. 963D and 330DL. I got these on a sale at 3000toys.com. So, I mean, they're half off. I mean, who can't resist a deal half off for $70 and 40 I got them for half off, so I had to buy them. Okay, I'm going to start off with the 963D track loader. Everybody, most of everybody has a 963D, but I don't. That's why I needed one. Because I just try to go with what lots of people have, so I don't look like a zero. Scissors behind the camera. I don't know if you can see it or not. I'm sorry if you can't. Let me undo the things in the back. Sometimes it's a whole lot easier just to unwind them. Here, I got the first one done. Hold on, I need to get something. Okay. Actually, I just checked the time. It's a little left. It was like four minutes, so. Here it is right now. I don't know. See, I'm undoing the things on the back, the little tie downs. I'm glad that Norscott does care about the packaging, but they might care just a little bit too much. I mean, it's okay. It's just whenever you have the model right in front of you, the first thing you want to do is try like see if everything works okay instead of just spending five to ten minutes unboxing it. So that could be something they worked on. They could work on a little bit. Now I will cut these off. There they go, flying off. Gosh. I'll clean those up.
And I want to tell you something about my diorama. I, w I did say, some people know, it, or well, I post it in every one of my videos. It's going to be a coal mine, but, dude, because I got some rock that looked like rock from a coal mine. Or, I mean, rock quarry, which it actually was. So I decided to make it a rock quarry instead, so then I don't have to buy the coal that Woodland Phoenix offers, because right now I'm a little short on cash. These things off. No clue how to get these off. I've never done this one before. The only other model with metal trucks I have is the D6T. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on. I was just checking out to see if the hydraulics moved smoothly. Okay, how the heck do I get this off? Please leave a comment if there's an easier way. Just say I'm doing it like four times harder than it probably needs to be. I mean, it looks so much easier in the video that you other guys make it, so. If you guys feel a little bit of a like a breeze in the camera. I have a fan on down here, so. What I'll probably do is I'll make the 330 DL in a different video. Yeah, I will. I'll have to. It's taking me way too long for this. Or it might. Let me check the time. Yeah, I'm going to have to do a different video. So thanks for watching, guys. Please comment, rate, subscribe. I'm going to do this. Really. Thanks, guys.